DJ Finest. Hey, hey, this is Sammy with the high damn advice. Hi chicas, it's Luis Ia and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. For today's video, I'm gonna share to you how to make your lashes look long and stay curled the whole day using a mascara. So if you have been a long time subscriber of mine, you know I love making um, makeup tutorials for beginners. So this specific video is for eyelashes. So actually I've seen a lot of comments saying that my lashes looks pretty because it's very long. How do you curl it? What mascara do you use? So I'll be answering all those questions right now and sharing my tips and tricks on how to make your lashes look long and stay curled the whole day. So the first step that I would share with you is to clean in your eyelash curler chicas this is very important like i know a lot of us very lazy to clean our makeup tools like dumaan na yung time na super na puno na dyan yung parang dried mascara and it doesn't look nice and every time i use it it kind of hurts already kasi parang dumidikit na yung lashes ko dun sa duming na ipon you can clean it with the wipes with the makeup remover wipes or any wipes na meron kayo dyan now that we're done cleaning our eyelash curler the next tip or trick that I'm gonna be sharing with you is something I learned from YouTube as well. So a lot of vloggers, beauty vloggers have shared this trick. So if you already know this trick, um, great. But for those who doesn't know it yet, this is heating your eyelash curler. So just like our hair, when you want to curl it, we use a flat iron or a curling iron, which is also hot. Mainit yon para magstay yung curl ng hair mo. So for our eyelashes, we're gonna do that right now. So this time, I'm gonna be sharing with you how I heat my eyelash curler. Other people use a hair dryer or a blow dryer to heat their eyelash curler but for me I feel like it's easier when you use a A lighter. So wait lang, make sure na you are at the right age to use a lighter. Like 12 years old below, please, 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 wag nyo na Just use a blow dryer or hair dryer of your mom that is safer. This is just my own preference kasi feeling ko mas mabilis makahit it ang lighter. So let me just zoom in so that you can see how I heat my eyelash curler. So make sure that it's open like this para hindi na masunog yung rubber. Heat the upper part. Kung saan didikit yung eyelash nyo. Be careful. And then the front. Now, time to test the temperature. Temperature. <laughs> Try nyo it test kung gano siya kainit. Kasi ayaw nyo naman masunog yung eyes nyo, guys. Make sure it's not too hot, not too cold. So now it's time to curl our lashes. So this is how my eyelashes look like without it being curled or without any mascara. It's super straight, like you cannot see the beauty of the length of my eyelashes because it's facing downwards. So with the right temperature, not too hot, not too cold, let's start curling our eyelashes. So what I like to do is look downwards like this and then I open my eyes as wide as I can. And then I try to get all the lashes that I could get and then start curling at the roots. And I pump like this. I do it in multiple pumps. I want to do it like this para mas maganda yung curl niya. After sa roots, you're gonna start again in the middle with the same procedure. Pump, pump, pump. And then after the middle part, you curl also the edge, the top edge of your lashes. Para paganto siya, hindi isang straight na pataas lang. Take as much time as you need to perfect the curl because it's very important. And there! Look at that curl! Finally, the difference. And now that I'm done curling, I'm gonna get a clean spoolie. So this is from my old eyebrow pencil that I don't use anymore. So I use this to like brush it off para maghiwa-hiwalay yung strands ng lashes para hindi siya dikit-dikit when we put on the mascara. So you just wanna like do this. Parang brush brush mo lang siya. There, para hiwa-hiwalay. Now that we're done curling the lashes, it's time for the mascara. So for the mascara that I'll be using is from L'Oreal. This is the Voluminous Lash Paradise. This is my ultimate favorite mascara. It gives that effect of a long voluminous lashes, guys. It's really, really great. This is waterproof. Perfect for that long-lasting um, curled lashes. It's very important that you use a waterproof mascara para mas tumagal yung curl ng lashes mo unlike other mascara na hindi waterproof. And another 
thing that I love about Lash Paradise is that it gives that perfect volume for your lashes. Like, if na problema kayo na manipis yung strands nung lashes nyo, don't worry because Lash Paradise got you. So this is not sponsored. I just really love this mascara. And when it's time to take it off, it's very easy. Unlike other mascara na grabe ang sakit anong mata mo, inaalis mo pa rin. But this one, kapag gusto mo na siya alsin, maaalis talaga siya. So for my next tip, this is perfect for those who have mascara that is over 3 months. Like if you still want to use your mascara, even though it's starting to dry out or like it's getting flaky, this tip is perfect for you. Like me, this is my favorite mascara and gusto ko siyang masulit. Gusto ko talaga gamitin until maubos na yung product. So the tip is get a cup of hot water and then you just put the mascara and then yun lang. Yun na yun. <laughs> no! So the product inside of this container it will start to melt. Like, hindi siya super dry na when you, you use the mascara. Kasi, tendency for mascara is madry agad siya. Kasi may pumapasok na hangin sa container. So, with hot water, it will help it um, melt yung mga natuto yung mascara nyo. So, when you're opening your mascara, guys, you don't wanna do this ever. So, you just wanna do it in circular motion when you're trying to get the wand and all the product that you need. Kasi yung iba ginaganito yung mascara nila. Please don't kasi papasok yung hangin sa loob ng container and magdadry agad yung mascara nyo. And then when I finally get the wand, look at that wand. It's so nice, so fluffy. What I love to do is take out the excess product kasi you don't wanna put a lot on your eyelashes. It's gonna turn out to be clumpy. Yung iba ginagawa sa tissue but sayang naman. Dito nyo nalang ilagay kasi sa tissue. So finally, let's put on the mascara. You want to start at the very roots of your eyelashes and then jiggle it upwards. Upwards. Jiggle like this. You want to do it like this. Other people want to close their eyes like this. But I feel like that's messy. And as you can see, there mga black jar na dumiket gawa ng wand mo. Don't worry, you're gonna take it off after it's dried out. Never ever like smudge it hanggat hindi pa tuyo yon. So make sure that you're gonna let it dry. So after one coat, you wanna check if okay niyan sa inyo because other people want it natural or other people want it more volumized. So for me, looking now, it's very nice. Like, ang cute niya lang. Like, nagpa-lash lift ka ba, girl? And I'm gonna be like, no, that's natural. Kinerl ko lang yan. Charot. <laughs> but ganyan, ganyan yung isang coating. But if you wanna add more, you can. But as for me, if gusto ko pa or like, nakukulangan ako, gagamitin ko lang yung next part nung brush. Kasi di ba ginamit natin isang part lang. And then may product pang naiwan sa likod. Ayan. And yung isang part, wala na kasi nalagay na natin dito para I don't have to go back to the container again. So, I'm just gonna add more coating. Like here in the inner part kasi hindi ko siya masyadan nalagyan kanina. And at the back. There! This is what I like. Hindi masyadong makapal. Pero halatang nag-effort sa paggawa ng ano mo, lashes. So I think this is already dried out. So I just wanna like use my nails or like my fingers to like get it off. Ayan, wala na siya. And then let's start on to the lower lashes. So you just wanna do this. And then, you know, brush it off. Other people tend to forget the lower lashes and I think it's very important na lagyan nyo din siya ng mascara. Now that we're done with the lower lashes, you can see na dikit-dikit siya and may parang particles na black na hindi maganda. So you just wanna let it dry first and then take it off later. But for now, since itong upper part dry na, that's the perfect time you wanna brush it using a clean spoolie. So again, going back to my spoolie, this one, I wanna brush it off sa taas here and then i roll it like this umiikot dapat siya guys like you brush it ng umiikot like that let me show you ayan oh dumidikit siya dun sa spoolie and then you brush it ng paikot para maghiwa-hiwalay sila and then sa baba naman pataas para magstay yung curl kasi kanina parang clumpy siya and now it's more natural strands of lashes and now at the lower lashes you just wanna brush it off 
Now look at that difference. Mas buha yung eyes natin dito, and it's not very trying hard. Like natural curl lang siya, and with that right amount of mascara. I'll get back to you guys. I'll just do this other side first. And this is how it looks like when they're both curled and with mascara. They're looking so cute. Ayan, feel na feel ko na yung aking lashes. The only problem that I'm seeing right now is that here, the edges, they tend to like meet each other. Like, nagdidikit sila dyan. Katulad din ito. So what I wanna do is to separate them both. Like, I'm gonna use this part of the curler, like yung sa babay, like yung hawakan, to like just separate them. Like that, para hindi sila mag meet. For my last step that I want to share with you is that when your lashes are really curled up, na papansin yun, nakikita yung white dun sa eyes nyo. So I'm gonna use an eyeliner to fill that in. This will make an effect na mas thicker yung lashes nyo. So you just wanna put it on this part of the eyes. So let me just show you. Like ayan, kita nyo guys, kita yung white dun sa eyes. Ito hindi masyado, but we're still gonna fill that in. This will create an illusion that your lashes are thicker. There you can see that there is like an illusion na parang may line. So people might really think na naka-fake lashes kayo, but in reality, it's just an eyeliner to fill out the white spots of your eyes. I promise you guys, this will stay the whole day. You don't have to curl every now and then, and people will really see the difference with your lashes. They're gonna think na nagpa-lash lift ka, or like extension, but in real life, it's just how you curl your lashes. It's really how you put the mascara, and how you like put effort in it. So yeah, it really takes so much time to like fix your lashes and everything but it's very worth it it makes a huge difference on your eyes and that's it chica for this video how to make your lashes look long and stay curled the whole day thank you for watching see you in my next video bye love lots